Hello and welcome back to Payday 2 101 with your host as always, Madrybred. Today I'll be analyzing the Clarion Rifle and the Deagle Pistol. Keep in mind that all these weapons are heavily modded as we're looking to the long-term potential of each weapon. First with the Clarion Rifle. The Clarion Rifle is basically the primary of an SMG. It boasts an impressive rate of fire as well as being all around more useful than the average SMG because of its fantastic accuracy. First for the pros, great rate of fire, great accuracy, breaks the 40 damage threshold, and has great stability. For the cons, too small of a magazine size to make full use of its fire rate. The Clarion Rifle is both a fun and useful gun, but its only advantage over the Car 4 is that it shoots faster, but because of its half the magazine size of the Car 4, it isn't able to fully take advantage of that. If the Clarion had 60 to 90 bullet magazines, I'd say that is better than the Car 4, but as it stands now, you're better off using single shots with the Car 4 than you would be doing short bursts with the Clarion. All of the time you'll waste reloading adds up fast and could have been spent shooting. The Clarion is a very fun gun, but not quite as good as the Car 4. Now onto the next weapon with the Deagle. The Deagle pistol is one of the two major powerhouse pistols. Its damage has been debuffed a bit because of Gunslinger Ace being changed, however, it retains most of its headshot tiers. For the pros, fantastic damage per bullet and good accuracy. For the cons, a very small ammo pool. Overall, the Deagle is a very unimpressive weapon. As amazing as the damage is, its critically tiny ammo pool means that it doesn't even hold two magazines worth of ammo with the extended magazine. On nearly every enemy you fight, the damage is so high that it's complete overkill and the job could have been done by a far weaker gun without wasting so much ammo. Every one bullet on the Deagle is easily worth six bullets for smaller pistols that could have killed the same enemies just as easily without the constant hunt for ammo or reliance on ammo bags. I recommend against using the Deagle. That's it for this episode of Payday 2 101. On the next episode, we go into more weapon guide videos. If you're interested in this series and would like to watch more, link to the playlist will both be on screen as well as in the description. This series will be ever updating as new patches change the game, so I'll keep you guys up to date. If you want to play Payday 2 with me, I play with the viewers on my streams whenever I stream Payday 2. You'll see a link to my hitbox stream in the description. If you're looking for some teammates to play with, why not join my Steam group linked in the description. And if you want to keep up with me, my Facebook fan page and Twitter are linked down there as well. Feel free to request I talk about anything in the game as long as I don't have a video on it in the playlist and I look forward to seeing everyone's feedback. If you want to see me play some more Payday 2, click the video on the left to see my series Payday 2 A Journey. And if you want to see me play a different game, the video on the right is of my newest Let's Play. That's it for this video, thank you for watching and until next time, have a nice day.